At least nine people have been killed and 11 others injured after militants attacked a, a police checkpoint in the North Sinai. Security forces have located the corpse of one of the attackers. They hope it will help in identifying the group. No one has yet claimed responsibility for the attack, but analysts believe it is similar to previous ISIL attacks in the area. It was more of a war. According to security officials, around 20 militants surprised the police checkpoint in Al-Arish city. They attacked using RPGs, a car bomb, machine guns, and they have also planted several other bombs around the area to cause more damage. One vehicle used was a garbage truck that was reported stalling two days before the attack. The police said its troops managed to explode the car bomb before it reached its buildings. Still, a major part of the police headquarters was destroyed. Three floors of the building were nearly collapsed. More bodies may still be under the rubble. More weapons and grenades have been found near the scene as the police chased the perpetrators. Another group attempted a second attack on a different checkpoint, but the police say the second attack failed. No group has immediately claimed responsibility, but analysts say it's a similar tactic ISIL Sinai province held before in previous attacks. For over three years, security forces have been trying to limit attacks that target police and army troops. And despite several announcements of major breakthroughs in securing the North Sinai area, the attacks continue. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Egypt.